Willkommen zu einer neuen Folge Dragon Quest 11. Wir sind auf dem Weg nach Antigia. Und hier laufen wir wieder diese ganzen komischen Drachenviecher rum. Wir haben in der letzten Folge haben wir Serena noch getroffen. Was aber einen Rückschluss bedeutet. Wir brauchen dieses Ei. Äh, dass Veronica nicht in der Gruppe mehr ist. Also, die haben sich getrennt, die beiden. Easy going. Ach, das ist Wir müssen ja mit dem hier rumrennen. Oh. Hey, Box, der Schatz. So, wir müssen ja hier erstmal hoch. Lustiges Straußen Eiborg. Also Leute. Das wäre jetzt gewesen, wenn der da runtergesprungen wäre. Oh. Diese Steinfächer, die nerven, weil die einfach nichts können. Wir sind ja schon mal oben. Ach, diese Eibox, die sind doch einfach lustig. Goldene Höhle von Güt, der Güldenhalle. Okay, er sieht echt nicht gut aus. This is awful. It was so beautiful here before. Our poor little angels. Veronica, Serena, please come back. We'll do anything. Fidelis, Alma, you must not lose hope. Veronica and Serena are the heirs to the power of that most holy of sages. As long as they are together, there is nothing that can... Oh. Serena? Is it really you? Mother? Father? You're alive! Oh, Serena, my little angel. I never thought I'd see you again. Serena, my child, have you come back to us? Alone? What of Veronica? She, she's not here. B but I thought she must have made her way home already. <sighs> she's certainly somewhere nearby. I can sense it. Somewhere north of here.
You can really tell where she is? Hmm. Yes, it's her. I know it is. We have to go and find her. Oh man, ey. Natürlich. Okay, dann... Gehen wir da mal hin. Oh, vielleicht sollten wir vorher nochmal uns ausruhen. Das macht irgendwie mehr Sinn. Was sieht aus wie ein Hotel? Komm, übernachten einfach mal. Vielleicht findet Veronica ja auch den Weg von alleine, wenn man einfach nur lange genug wartet. Aber ich bezweifle das. Der Weg wurde hier gezeigt, also gehen wir da mal hin. Hein der Ruhe. Wenn wir, die, wenn wir sie jetzt bei uns in der Truppe haben. Da ist unsere Gruppe wieder vollständig. You think Veronica's really here? If she is, she's keeping a low profile. When we were children, Veronica and I would often come to this grove to play. I was sure she would be waiting for me here. Veronica! Veronica, where are you? Oh. Huh? <gasps> ah, there she is. I knew it. <sighs> <laughs> Wake up, lazy bones. You'll catch cold sleeping outside like this. Veronica? Hmm? <gasps> Look, her staff is shining, and so is the mark on your hand. Do you think if you touch it, you might have one of your visions? Das letzte, was ich doch gesagt habe, war Comeback, oder? Veronica, you gave your life to save us.
No! Your final moments, you were thinking of your friends. No! Oh, Veronica. <sighs> Why must the good die young? here after all. She's gone. But I will not let her death be in vain. Where she led, I must follow. I have to tell everyone. I have to tell mother and father. Ja, ich glaube, wir sollten sie mal begleiten, ne? Serena überbringt den Bewohner von Antika die traurige Nachricht von Veronikas Opfer. Noch am selben Tag halten die Bewahrer der eine Zeremonie zu ihrem Gedenken ab. O oh, great and glorious Yggdrasil, whose holy heart is the symbol of all life, today we mourn the loss of a beloved child of Arborea. Though she came into life with another of your hallowed leaves, she departed this realm alone. May she one day return to you and bloom again upon your branches. I thank you all for gathering here today to celebrate the life of my dear sister. Even in her darkest hour, Veronica thought not of herself, but only of protecting the luminary. She was a keeper to the last. Now, I ask that each of you offer up a lock of hair to the sacred flame, that its light may guide her on her way back to the world tree. My little angel. Ah. Curse you, Mordigan. Why could you not have taken me instead? My darling, darling daughter. How could you leave us without saying goodbye? Serena appears steadfast despite her grief. But the sight of her poor parents is heartbreaking indeed. My child, I must speak with you and your friends. When you have a moment, please come to the cathedral. Yeah, I'm gonna run. We don't know where the cathedral is. Forgive me for summoning you here at this time of sadness, but there is something I believe you will be eager to hear. 
You came in search of the sacred conveyance upon which Erdwin and his allies rode out to face the Dark One, did you not? How did you know that? For well, some days before your arrival, Holy Yggdrasil granted me another vision. I saw you, honored luminary. You were standing alongside Serena upon a great white object that transported you to an island in the sky. A strange and beautiful place. And you think this was a vision of the future? I do. For in my dream, Veronica was not with you. I have been greatly troubled as to what her absence might mean. I had hoped and prayed that my fears were unfounded, yet, alas, they were not. Which made me wonder if the conveyance upon which you stood might also be real. And then, I remembered. Cetacea. The legends tell of a divine being who soared through the skies on silver wings, a beast summoned to Erdwin's side by a mystical melody. Perhaps it was upon Cetacea's back that you rode in my vision. And perhaps the island upon which you alighted is the next step on your journey. I intend to scour the annals for indications of how she might be summoned. I will inform you forthwith if my researches should prove fruitful. Now, the day's unhappy events have surely taken their toll. Rooms have been prepared for you all at the inn. Pray, rest a while. Es muss ja schon irgendwelche... Es können ja nur acht Leute sein. Aber irgendwie... Ronaldo, Erik, Bodo... Theoretisch... Merkwürdig. Weil theoretisch könnte man die Gruppe einmal komplett austauschen, wenn sie drauf ist. Deswegen wundert es mich, warum wir noch nicht, äh, warum jetzt die jetzt Veronica rausgenommen haben. Oder schaffen wir es, sie später wieder zu beleben? Das wäre natürlich auch irgendwie krass. trägt die Luft die klagenden Klänge einer Harfe an Freds Ohr. Schrägstrich unser Ohr. Ja, das, und das erste, was wir tun, ist natürlich in den Schrank gucken. It's a love song from the Age of Heroes. The story of a lady pining for her long-lost sweetheart. No one remembers who wrote it, 
but I've loved it since I was a little girl. You know, something's been bothering me. Veronica? We were born at the same time, so our leaves bloomed at the same time, didn't they? Do you think they'll fall at the same time, too? Hmm, I don't know. You've always been a bit slow, to be honest. But I hope they do. <sighs> Serena, I want you to promise me something. If anything happens to me, promise you'll finish this without me. <gasps> I shan't promise anything of the sort. I don't even want to think of such things. If only I had promised to do as she asked. Perhaps she might have been able to make her sacrifice more easily. She was right, you know. I always have been slow. When it came to talking or walking or learning magic, I was always a step behind her. But now I must tread my own path. Alone. <laughs> I hate to ask, but would you mind awfully not going anywhere for a little while? I think I'm going to cry. <laughs> Thank you. I'm sorry to be such a bother, but I shan't be one any longer. Veronica died to save me. I must make the most of my life, for her sake. Warum macht man das? No more tears. That was the old me. Goodbye. What in the world? I feel... different. <gasps> Thank you, dear sister. Serena kann jetzt alle Zauberfähigkeiten Veronicas verwenden. Okay, das ist aber jetzt eigentlich nicht mehr so wirklich... Mhm. Okay. Okay. Ist es so gut oder schlecht, dass der Heiler mehr Schaden macht?
Good morning, or should I say good afternoon? The sun's already high in the sky. Father Benedictus dropped by earlier. He says he has something to show us at the top of the mountain. Everyone else has gone on ahead, but I thought I'd wait for you. Shall we go and join them? There's a little door to the right of the cathedral. The path is through there. Okay. Dann können wir jetzt einen Blick auf ihre Fähigkeiten werfen. Klarinebaukasten. Man muss es auch nicht übertreiben. Guck mal, wie viele Dinger sie da schon hat. Ne? Zauberstelle, was haben wir hier? Das Tolles. Einmal Marta, ja. Man braucht sie auf jeden Fall mehr MP. Dann auf. Das Echo. 65. Also. Die haben quasi Veronicas Fate. Einfach auf ihres draufgepackt, habe ich das Gefühl, ne? Sie kann mit Speeren angreifen. Ach ja, okay, das ist dieses half -Kram. Komm. Das geben wir ihr einfach mal. Mag schon macht plus 10. Das jetzt. Gucken wir mal, was die anderen beiden sind hier. Chance auf Kräftigung plus 10%. Das ist auch mega, mega heftig, das so. Also heißt das Sparen. Da fehlt ein Punkt. Da fehlen 20. Ja. Der kann hier Antima gelernt. Gucken wir mal, was das da ist. Das ist natürlich auch cool. Aber gut, ich würde sagen, wir machen hier einen Cut, wenn es euch gefallen hat. Dota, 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 und schalten die nächste Folge ein. Bis denn!